Hey, sir. You see? Oh, you see? You looking at me? <laughs> By the way, sir, uh, wait a minute, hold on, y'all, sir. I'll be right back with the restroom. Oh, shucks, sweetie. Hey, sir! Wait, what's the matter with you? Hey, I don't know. Oh, baby. Everybody, the Shirley May. And with a third. TV show. Well, Shirley, uh, I've been seeing on the news about this, uh, what do you call it? Coca Cola virus? <laughs> what do you call it? What in the world is that? Colonia, Columbia, what's up? What do you call it? <laughs> Where you a mess? Where that virus going around making people sick? It's called a coronavirus. A oh, coronavirus? Yeah. Oh, yeah, Shirley, what you, that's, that's bad, that, though. You know, you know, we're here in the last day. Woo! Where do you set them out for then? A lot of people out there they're going in there for the doctor for the flu. And I have something like that. That's that is devastating, Shirley. Mm, mm, mm. I tell you the truth. You're too, that. too old for that stuff. Yeah, no, I tell you the truth. That's something serious there, boy. I tell you the truth. Oh, because I will never get that. Not, uh, me or you, my family. I, I, I don't find nobody, period. I don't yeah, find nobody. Y'all yeah, know what? Have you ever noticed every year there's always some kind of sickness? that's taking people out in numbers. Yeah. And when, the thing about it is, hmm, I'm gonna say this now. This Shirley May opinion and her theory, okay? Yeah. I believe it's the government. Yeah, I heard too, Shirley. Yeah, but she has to let us know seek out like that from the government. No, go around, so let's that's it. People. Y'all, y'all remember this thing when they talk about the anthrax, um, Y2K, the world gonna blow up. Oh, yeah, boom, boom, boom. Oh, yeah, wait yeah, it. Really, yeah. <laughs> I just don't know what, what is wrong with these people? But Shirley, that's real, man, don't say, you know, cause the young people, they may have a chance to fight that, that virus off, but the old people like, oh, oh no, no, I no. Know, I don't know what to say what happened to us. Wait, I just don't know what to say, cause I feel like, you know, if, some, if we was to catch something like this with, I don't think we'll be able to survive. Uh, we're too old. We're too old. If you start letting all that stuff seek out like that, you should start making a cure for the cure that stuff to let people that's die. That's it. That's it. Yeah, you know, I'm sorry, y'all. My hair is just all over the place today. Just bear with me. You look all right, baby. Don't worry about it. All right. At least you tell the truth, baby. But it's like this right here. I'm going to say this. Everything works, you know, accordingly. Yeah. Okay. In order for you to fight off certain things, your immune system has to be strong, right? Yeah. Okay, it all starts with this right here. Y'all don't mind my nails. I know they tag you. I'm going to take care of them. Y'all got to keep, keep your hands clean in the You got to wash your hands. And let me tell you something. Y'all, y'all, hold on just a minute. I'm going to bring a few things that I keep around the house. Now, hold on. Hold down for me, Whitney. Girl, come back, though, Shirley. Okay, Whitney. Yeah, you gotta make sure you always keep your hands clean, though, Shirley. Oh yeah, most definitely. And yeah, when uh, we going over to like the airport, the airports and stuff like that. You know it. You gotta man. uh, make sure you don't touch them. Make sure you sanitize. What do you call it? Sanitization. Yeah, you know it. You gotta have all these things. Yeah. <laughs> Shirley, ain't no way you get all that stuff from Shirley. Come bring all that stuff now. And build, and build twelve gallon bucket of uh, bleach. <laughs> we ain't gonna bring all that big twelve gallon bucket of bleach like that. Now y'all know. Oh, oh, I'm gonna drop this stuff. Where you somebody how like you crazy? <laughs> the lights all came. Shut up, you don't be able to pick all that. You just clean up now? <laughs> no, y'all. But anybody, y'all, my brother, we're crazy. Hey, Craig, you probably brought that stuff there. Got some, uh, what, what's it called? Let's put the purple stuff on. Uh, Where you hush? Let me talk. Oh. A slap of slow, slow? Where God, you no. shout to hit? Y'all, like I was saying. Oh, fuck, not that. We don't mind this show. And also <laughs> with your hands, okay? So the first thing you should do, stop touching your face. Stop putting your hand all in your face, all in your mouth. Those are germs. You know, just like these old phones or whatever, every night, every day, we come in from work, we try to make sure we sanitize our hands, I mean our phones, and we do so by using some Clorox wipes. Y'all, y'all, excuse me, I'm old school. I keep it in a Ziploc bag because I'm going to keep them, them moisture in there. Yeah. That's what we do. We wipe our phones down. Oh, you blow your nose or something, wash your hand. Don't put your hand back in your pocket. You know it. Wait a minute, man. What's oh. the proper way you're supposed to blow, you're supposed to sneeze? Oh, sneeze into your... There you your go. Like that you sneeze into here because all of your particles is going to get into your nose. Yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. 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 Yeah,
is gonna go there. You sneezing in the air, guess what? I learned this. It stay in the air for so long. Yeah, they get your smart. They first walk outside. They get sick. You get sick. I'm like, hit you. Oh, shit. What's wrong with you? You you sneeze like this. You say, hit you. You know, you go into your arm. Yeah, one time I tried to say, hit you. The show like my neck was hurting. I was going to my neck or something. Then I tried to hold my nose sometimes. I sneeze. I forgot. Oh, we hush. Okay, y'all. I said, wash your hands, right? Wash your hands. Then I use Wash your hands. Right? Then I use wash your hands. After you get through washing your hands, dry them off, follow up with some hand sanitizer. If you can't wash your hand with no soap, keep some hand sanitizer. This video is not sponsored. Sorry, y'all. I hate to come out of care. And like I was telling you, I said, we like to go. Somebody trap by the top, you touch them doors and stuff, make sure you, you wash your hands. Right? You wash your hands. Oh, you touch them doors, then try to take You know, I'll take some of these wipes with you, you know? Oh, yeah. Uh, you know, I just make sure that everything be clean. If you ain't got no hand sanitizer, go to Dollar Tree and pick up one of these Lysol bottles and take your bucket of bleach with you. <laughs> with you yeah. crazy. Get you like a Ziploc bag and uh, put some, uh, a rag or something in there and put some of this on there, Stop. you know? And around the house, you know, even I take this with us sometimes. I get us a can of Lysol. Yes, Shirley, spit all my money on that cleaner. Don't tell my Shirley. Yeah. I say, what was cleaner? Shirley, she'll spit all the money on cleaner stuff. What's your food or something? Y'all, it's like this. I'm OCD and I'm sorry. I don't apologize. No. But well, Shirley, you gotta stop spending more money on products than you do food, though. We don't gotta eat too now. When? Because that could have been a hell sandwich for me, Shirley. But you gotta tell the truth, when? Have you got sick? I ain't got sick, but I'll be hungry. Okay, though. well then. Man, sick with that. If you hungry, that ain't no good. Well, you know, you just shut up. Everybody, everybody know you ain't hungry because you're too healthy. You yeah, I know. Fussy. I'm saying, but you be big, still be hungry. Oh, yeah, right, well, You be dead. So, I'm gonna every fluid on you, dog. Be no all the way on every fluid on you, Shirley. Ain't nothing. And then my final cleaning product that I keep around the house at all times, even if I'm washing dishes, and I will use this on my door knobs as well. Baby, get you some. Bleach. Get you some bleach. And they don't wash you guys. She got my five more back there in the back room. All right, wait. Don't tell for me now. Okay, I'm sorry, sir, but I'm going to tell you too. I'm going to let you clean up, sir. Baby, they know when they when I get on this camera, they know me. If I get all work out, as soon as I come in, hit the door, and I hear, I smell bleach, fabuloso, <laughs> that, uh, what you call us, no, uh, Arm and Hammer, uh, Ajax, everything, they get together. Whatever, well, man. All right, Shannon. But the point is, you guys, make sure that you guys are washing your hands. This is where all this stuff comes from. You know, all these germs and stuff. Just make sure you wash your hands. And I also seen on the news too with What Shirley? They said some of these foods and stuff that people going in the grocery store getting because you know it's coming from China over there. They saying that the food is infected. Y'all better wash y'all stuff real good or don't eat that stuff at all. Go back to the old days where they do they do the homegrown stuff. And that thing too sure. I saw on the news a restaurant had to close because the the uh Show yeah, and to the people on that show. Yes, they did. They said once they get it clear back up, they'll open back. I don't eat that no way, though. You know what? It's going to kill me. You wouldn't need to stop eating over there, because we don't know where them people getting their food and stuff. Yeah, like, you know, they think the Chinese food comes from China. You know it. Yeah. Who's going to be eating that? No, no. No, I know Shannon made with her no Chinese food, but we ain't eating that. No, no, no. I know, no, no. know y'all got to go with that, but I ain't trying to rush my time. Oh, no. And wait a minute, y'all. And I'm going to get off of here. I'm going to share it with you what the symptoms of this deadly virus it does to your body. They said, how deadly is it? So sure they don't to live through it. With it. They said about 2% of the reported cases have been fatal, but many experts say that the death rate could be lower. That's because early in the outbreak, mild illness may not be reported. If only a person was severe who are more likely to die. To die. Okay. So, with so it's I mean, so by grace of God, you still pull through with them, sir. Might be a miracle. It may be a miracle, cause this virus is so harsh on your body. We don't know if you will make it. It'll well, only be by the grace of God. Well, I said that's what you do. For keep not getting it, just keep just keep yourself clean. You won't get it. Y'all stop traveling out of the country while all this mess going on. Cause if you go over there, you know you are gonna have to eat that stuff. So yeah. leave that stuff alone. If they let that stuff alone, let it alone, sugar. And you know what? When I seen one of our good friends on there, on on this uh in our community, he our friend. Yeah, probably the uh right I don't know uh I forget his you name. Don't mess the name up, but you know he know who he is, I guess. Y'all, if I think about his name, I I put him in the description down below. He was telling people. 
So always keep some emergency supplies in your home. That's food and you know, if you need cleaning supplies and stuff. So make sure you get them canned beans though, sugar pork Yes, beans. he did. He said, make sure you keep some poke peanut beans, butter because yeah, that was protein. And you know what? I said, that man is absolutely right. Oh, yeah. And the reason why I say he right is because we too stuck on these fast food delivery companies, Uber Eats, DoorDash, not sponsored. They blow up, up all of them. You know, stop eating out. Go on and cook your home cooked meal. Well, that's our time for now, and we're going to get on up out of here, and we'll see y'all until next time. All right, peace.